Hello again everybody, it's Jesse Ladner here and on this video today, as you see, I got the Impossible Whopper from Burger King. So, basically this is going to be my reaction video of the Impossible Whopper here. And I just got it here, picked it up, and here we go. We're going to try it out, see how it tastes. Hmm. Not bad. Start with. Of course, the only thing I didn't get on it is cheese because I didn't want cheese. So I gotta say, it tastes just like a like a regular Whopper would, pretty much. Definitely tastes just like a Whopper would, so. Mm hmm. I gotta tell y'all, it's really good. And really, really good. I gotta say. I don't see I don't see any reason why it's impossible. I mean it said it's made out of plants, but hey, it tastes just like a regular Whopper would. Ow, bit my lip. Y'all need to go pick y'all self up a um impossible whopper. It's really good. Mm-hmm. I mean I put you know everything on it except cheese. That's what I asked. And of course I got some fries here. And they were, I was going to get sweet tea, but then apparently they were out, so I just got root beer instead. Oops. Um, yeah, so they were out of sweet tea, unfortunately. We got root beer. It's, it's um propped up behind my phone, of course. I'll try to show it here in just a little bit. And I guess they were out of the big cups, as you can see. Well, I mean, I don't understand. There was hardly anyone working there. I mean, I don't know if they were short of staff or what. So, yeah. Apparently, something happened. Took, it took them a little bit to get us our food. I mean, like I said, probably because due to the fact that they're short of staff and whatnot. So, I mean, I think when you get towards the middle, in my opinion, when you get towards the middle, it might have a little bit of a taste. Maybe not. I don't know. And, I, don't, I mean, it got a little bit of a different taste when you get towards the middle of the burger, but... Well, we got tomatoes in. Lettuce falling on over here. Mm-hmm. Really, really good, y'all. Y'all gotta go get y'all one. It's, I mean, it kind of, it's got a good kick. I think, in my opinion, it has a good kick in the, in the, um, outside, but in the, getting towards the middle might have a little bit of a different, of a taste, in my opinion. I mean, that's just my opinion. Yeah, I think getting towards the middle of the burger has a little bit of a different t taste to it, but it's still, it's not bad. 
I know, body hour pop. I'm oh, sorry. Where are my manners? Anyways, um, y'all probably jealous just watching me eat this whole Impossible Whopper. I haven't even ate my fries yet. I'm just trying to get this video over with. And you're probably wondering why I have this outfit on. Well, I was at church earlier today, so that's why I have this outfit, this shirt on. And, yeah, got out of church, went to go get some Burger King, tried Impossible Whopper. It's my first time trying it, so I thought I might make a reaction video. All right, let me... Gotta, oh, shoot. Yeah, see, I, I gotta be careful with that root beer. That's what gets me every time with that hiccup. That's why I can't slur I can't be drinking it too fast at a time. Because that's what happens. <laughs> yeah, so anyways, yeah, that hiccup gets me every time when I drink root beer. Alright, let's get back to finishing my possible Whopper here. Like I said, it's got a good taste. Unless that the different taste of the flavor is coming from the juice of the mayonnaise and whatnot. Maybe that's what it is. All right. This is really, really good. I mean, it tastes pretty much just like a regular Whopper would. Kind of just my phone there a little bit more. Yes, I know. Winnie the Pooh's right there. Just. Yeah. That, that's actually broken, by the way. I'll tell you what that's supposed to be doing. Um, the Christmas clock's going to go off, of course, but. So what Pooh Bear's over here is supposed to be doing, his head's supposed to move, and Piglet is actually inside his hat, right? So Piglet's supposed to come in and out, and apparently, well, I don't know to be sure, but I think one of the kids from a few years back messed it up. Not me. No, 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 not me. I think one of the kids done messed it up. So that's why we don't put batteries in it anymore. Alright. And, that, well, that's pretty much been my reaction video. Of course, I already know what the fries taste like. But, alright, well, that was, that's, that was my reaction video of the Impossible Whopper taste test. And, I gotta say, it like I said, I'll say it one more time, it tastes just like and a regular, what a regular Whopper would taste like. All right, everybody. Well, I'm gonna jump off here. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Hit like, hit subscribe, comment down below what you think, and tap the bell if you're so that way you'll know when my next, oh excuse me, when my next video is posted. And we will see you on the next one.